What's up everyone? Welcome to Clubit. My name is KB and today I'm going to show you how you can expand your Android mobile phone's RAM. You can expand up to 4 GB. This is a highly requested video by the one of my subscribers. A few things before we get started into this. Uh, first thing you will need a rooted phone if your phone is not rooted you don't have a root access then this method will not work this is the only way to expand the ram on android phones so yeah if your phone is not rooted go to the google and search for your phone's model number and say root and you will find a lots of method to root your android phone first thing you have to do is open the google play store something like this and search there at ram expander okay something like this ram expander and let it load after that you will see in the third option and select the rohi soft ram expander swap a third number of this one okay and i have already installed it and as you can see it is saying uninstall and open in your case it will say purchase it is a 9.99 dollars almost 10 dollars so make sure you have a good amount of money and after that you can buy this and i already installed it so i'm gonna open this after you have done downloading and installing just open it i'm gonna guide you through how to use this so this is the interface you will get and there is the option swap active or something like that so in the first layer you will see swap file option okay so you can you know this is the ram amount how much amount we want to add into our ram okay so it, it will work virtually so i'm gonna select 4000 megabyte okay it's uh, 4000 megabytes means 4 gigabyte so i'm gonna do select all of that and as you can see here uh, total free so i have a 3 gigabyte of ram right now as you can see 2.97 gigabyte so that's the full ram i have and you're gonna what you're gonna do is optimal values you're gonna click on that and gonna select your memory card or phone storage so i'm gonna use my phone storage i don't have a memory card installed and as you can see it is a 32 gigabyte of phone storage internal storage i'm gonna select that and okay and you will see uh, you can select the for what you need a ram like gamers balance multitasking so i'm gonna select the gamers i play lots of games so i'm gonna select the gamers you can select other things like balance multitasking or net gamer something like that so gamers is the best choice if you are a gamer so i'm gonna select okay and you will see the magic will be happening within a second please wait creating 3000 megabyte swap file this can go very long time wait a second i'm gonna wait for that and yeah let it finish its work and after that i will show you how much ram i can get from it now it has done its work it has finished writing the ram as you can see here uh, total ram we have the 5.90 gigabyte that's insane like you know uh, i had three uh, gigabyte ram only and now i have uh, almost six gigabyte i have plus three gigabyte more so that's how it works that's just simple as hell and if you want to deactivate this there is a toggle you're gonna deactivate this as you can see it will turn normal as you can see i have now i have a 2.97 gigabyte of ram only so uh, after that you don't have to configure this thing again and again uh, once you configure this what you have to do is toggle click on that toggle again on and off switch like this and it will turn on again and it will automatically write the swap file or you can call the virtual ram for you again and uh, yeah just you just have to wait for a second and it will activate again automatically so yeah that's all you have to do as you can see um, i now i have a 5.90 gigabyte of ram that is insane and what i have noticed is if i select the 4000 megabyte it won't work it will automatically decrease to the 3000 megabyte only so uh, i'm not able to select the 4000 megabyte maybe in your phone it will work and you know if in case it doesn't work for your phone what you can do is try the different different values like you know 1000 megabyte 2000 megabyte 3000 megabyte try the different values it will work definitely work so yeah try the different values if in case it doesn't work okay so yeah that's all you have to do and hope you enjoyed it i will also put link in the description for this to download go there and get this and yeah i will see you in the next one take care of yourself and have fun Bye-bye.